Hello, hello everyone. How are you guys doing? I hope you guys are doing great. This is teacher Michelle again. Today, the activity that we're gonna be making is Play-Doh. So for this activity, we're gonna be using these items. We're gonna be using a container. We're gonna be using some measuring cups and measuring spoons. We're gonna be using one cup, measuring cup. I'm using the one size one cup and one quarter, one quarter. I'm using the measuring tablespoon, one tablespoon. And I'm also using the one, the half of the tablespoon, okay? So I'm gonna be using these three cereals to make my Play-Doh. So, okay. So right here, I already have the things. I measure things. What we're gonna be doing uh, oh, and the materials to make this, we're gonna be using flour, flour. We're gonna be using salt. We're gonna be using water. We're gonna be using water. We're gonna be using cornstarch, cornstarch. We're gonna be using food coloring, food coloring to make it fun and colorful. And we're gonna be using some oil, okay? It doesn't matter the brand. You guys can always use what you guys have at home. So what we're gonna be using, since I already told you that I already have everything here measured, we're gonna be putting in our container the flour. We're gonna be putting the flour, all of it, all of it, okay? We're gonna be adding the water, only using one cup of water. We're gonna be adding the water, oh, look at that, water. I'm gonna be using one tablespoon of salt. One tablespoon of salt. Oh yes, everywhere. One tablespoon of salt. And I didn't have this ready. And I'm gonna be using the half spoon of corn of um, cream of tartar. All right. We only need a little bit of this. Only a little bit. Okay. So, and I'm gonna be using, I'm gonna reuse my one tablespoon again of oil. One tablespoon of oil. And I'm gonna add it here with the rest of my ingredients. Ooh, how are you guys doing? Are you guys doing it with me? Yes? Okay. So, and I'm gonna be using the food coloring. What color you guys want your play? It's up to you. This uh, box comes with four colors. So I'm gonna be probably, I'm gonna use blue. I'm gonna be using blue. And it depends of how you guys want your Play-Doh, if you guys want a strong blue, a dark blue, or light blue. So I'm, I wanted a light blue, I'm gonna use five drops. One, two, three, four, five. I wanted a light blue. Because if you guys add too much, the color is gonna be very strong. So after you guys are done mixing all the ingredients, you guys mix it really good. You guys are gonna get messy. Put your sleeves up like I did with mine. You're gonna get your Play-Doh like this. I already make some. I make red and I make green. Okay, look at the Play-Doh. Ooh, see this Play-Doh? Mm. It feels really, really good. It feels soft. It feels really soft and so if you guys want your play-doh to last longer this play-doh parents don't worry if you guys put it if your kids put it in your mouth which I don't recommend you guys putting it in your mouth in your mouth I mean but um, it's okay it's made with um, things that you know we that items that we use to cook so but if you want if you guys want your play-doh to last longer you guys can keep it in a Ziploc bag put it on a Ziploc bag and keep it in the fridge okay so i hope you guys like this activity you guys can use some forks or spoons that you guys have at home to practice your cutting or you guys can also use the other um, um items that we use for the other activities just to put them in here to make it more fun and find the things so hope you guys like this activity have fun with it i love you guys and i miss you guys so much okay see you guys next time